Ah, uh, yes, at least I, uh, I hope you can. I found this sonogram on the ground. I'm sure the parents must be missing it, but uh, unfortunately, the name's been torn off. Uh, I could use the patient ID code on that to find out who it belongs to. Really? Oh, how fortunate. I'll take care of this right away. Thank you. Why did you say you're here again? To personally inform you that I signed off on your discharge. You're being released from GH tomorrow. Once again, you become Pentonville's problem. So, bye-bye. I can't be released, Grid. I still need treatment here. You mean for your fabricated back pain? I'm sure your remaining test will prove that you're faking. Does Maxie know that I'm being transferred? Why would she? She's been very clear that she wants nothing to do with you, that you mean nothing to her. I'm Louise's father, Britt. And as long as Maxie and I share a child, we're bound together forever. How are you holding up? I know this is bringing back a lot of feelings for you being here, but has it sparked anything, maybe? Oh, oh, thank God you're not Peter. Thank God you're not a bear. No, no, nothing. Um, are you sure we're in the right place? The woods look really different in the winter. Uh, this is the spot. I grew up in these woods. I know them in every season. I passed that boulder right before I laid eyes on you. Good. Well, let's recreate it. Where was she? Right there. Here, have a seat. Try to replicate it as best you can, you know. So what do you remember? Hmm? How are you feeling? Um, scared, hurt, uh, helpless, very vulnerable. I was in pain, and I, um, I tried to keep running, but I couldn't because of the contractions. Honey, I'm sorry to make you relive it, but you gotta keep going on. Um, there was this light. I thought it was Peter. I thought he had found me somehow. But it wasn't Peter, right? It was me. And I introduced myself, you remember? Awesome. Maxie. So nice to meet you, Miss Max. Yeah, I do. Um, I was so happy to see you. I thought I was going to have to give birth all alone. Still, thank God Austin was there for you. So do I.